Hello everyone, it's Ryan with Frontline Animal Removal. Today I'm making a video on how to properly identify flying squirrels. Uh, lately we've had a few calls where people have had a small critter in the house and they don't know what it is. Their pet has caught and killed it and they think maybe it's a baby squirrel or a chipmunk. Um, and since most people in Ohio have never seen a flying squirrel, uh, I'm going to make this little video now. Uh, the first thing I want to tell you is the squirrel I'm using is a dead squirrel. And I'm using him because I can hold him up close and he's not going to move and wiggle around. Um, and so if you don't like dead things, don't watch the video. Okay, here we have our flying squirrel. As you can see, their skin flattens out, but usually when they're running, skin is all folded in nice and tight. They have a brown gray color on the back. They have this nice white light color on the belly. Their tails are the most prominent feature that gives away a flying squirrel. You can see it's flat. If we hold it in profile, I mean it's very flat. White on the bottom, gray on the back. Sometimes people will think these are chipmunks because there's a dark line right here along the side of the animal. Another thing that gives them away is they have large eyes. Now because this guy's dead, we're not going to see his eyes you know, opened up. But to give you an idea of how easily a flying squirrel can get into a building, here I have some mesh. This is one inch by one inch mesh. Now watch this. His little head goes right through. If he can get his little head through, the rest of his body will follow. So if you got flying squirrels in your house, we gotta go around and find all the openings. They're as big as this, because he'll just slip it right in like that. Very easily. And then once he gets his head through, he can squish his shoulders down and get his shoulders in. <clears throat> so, have nice long whiskers, big eyes, a brown gray color skin, bright white on the belly, and this dark line along the sides, and most prominently, the flat tail. So if you think you have a baby squirrel running around your house, take a good look. It might be one of these guys.